Is that true? It's what true? About Amy, that she's okay? No, she's not. Partly because of me. I contacted the local newspaper about that protest I did. I was going to do an interview, but um, I'm not now. I told him to do one. What made you change your mind? Amy doesn't want me to do it. What, because she doesn't want the publicity? She said she got it wrong about what happened with Aaron that night. So you mean he never? Well, not according to her. You don't seem too convinced. That's because I'm not. I think she's lying because she wants all of this to go away. Mm. Finally! I've been trying to get hold of you all morning. Sorry, I had my phone off. <sighs> what sort of lad your age has his phone off? Weirdo. Anyway, look, I've got some good news. Mm -hmm. I'll make a change. So, I was in the cafe earlier, and I overheard Tracy telling Adam that Amy's admitting she got it wrong about that night, about what happened between you and her. What? You mean she's... She's saying that I didn't force myself on her. Yes. So, touch wood, as long as the human Rottweiler Tracy McDonald backs off, you're going to be all right. <laughs> I don't believe it. <laughs> I honestly don't believe it. <laughs> it's all right. It's all over now. Come here. <laughs> oh. Believe him. I've done nothing wrong. Even Amy said I didn't do anything. There's no smoke without fire, if you ask me. Come on. Ignore him. People just want something to get irate about. I don't want anyone thinking bad of me. Then you're living on the wrong street. Look, just keep your head down, crack on with work, and it'll all blow over. Yeah, I wish I could. Well, you can, because I've had a word with Tyrone and told him what Amy said, and he says you can start back tomorrow. No more daytime TV for you, then. Thanks, Abby. I wish everyone around here was as nice as you. Oh, you didn't have the greatest of starts, and I've been guilty of messing up some people's starts in my time. So I'll knock a uh, buys around shoes and we'll call it even. Deal. Right then, Abbott, we've got an offer on pork scratchings. You buy one packet, you get the second at exactly the same price. Beautiful. <laughs> Two packets, please. 